I've been very fortunate to be involved with the development of a therapeutic laser for use in the equine athlete. Many lasers have been around since the 70s, all through the 80s and 90s, and basically the complaint all equine practitioners and the equine owners had was is that they were long on promises and short on clinical results. Technology became available about seven years ago that changed it. We now have the technology to provide the right wavelength for penetration into the tissue, the right amount of power, which is usually around 10 to 15 watts, and the right amount of application, the, the correct application techniques to allow the photons to penetrate deep in the tissue. Once those photons penetrate deep in the tissue, they cause a biochemical cascade of events that allows for almost an instantaneous state of analgesia. It breaks the inflammatory cycle and it increases the circulation to the area. Increased circulation, as everyone knows, is absolutely the goal of all physical therapy, of all healing. So I can honestly say that in my practice, the only thing I have that actually, that actually stimulates the animal to heal on a cellular level is laser therapy. There is nothing else available to us at this time that can do this. We're entering, thank goodness, we're entering the age of regeneration medicine, where we're allowing the horse to stimulate the horse to, to heal their own injuries and hopefully even to the point where we can prevent it.